NASA has given an update on Hidden Planet X, aka Nibiru and has given a stark warning about what will happen when it strikes Earth tomorrow. Nothing. Author David Mead says it's going to wipe out the entire planet because of a passage in the Bible, Revelation chapter 121. Incredible claims Tintin was in fact a girl sends web crazy the passage says a great sign appeared in heaven a woman clothed with the sun with the moon under her feet and a crown of twelve stars on her head. And being with child, she cried out in her travail and was in anguish of delivery. However, NASA has now poured water on the rumors. The space agency said various people are predicting that the world will end September 23 when another planet collides with Earth. The planet in question, Nibiru 6, doesn't exist, so there will be no collision. They gave a QA about Nibiru in 2012 answering why the world didn't end. If you change the dates 2017 and September 23, you get pretty much the same answers. NASA points out that the catastrophe was initially predicted for May 2003. People were loving this baby Jaguar wandering around the BBC studio but it didn't so it was moved to December 2012. There have been other similar predictions about this non-existent planet X Nibiru. NASA said there would be no major blackout in 2012 and we aren't expecting it this time either. To the direct question of Nibiru a planet X, NASA said Nibiru and other stories about wayward planets are an internet hoax. There is no factual basis for these claims. If Nibiru a planet X were real and headed for an encounter with the Earth in 2012, astronomers would have been tracking it for at least the past decade, and it would be visible by now to the naked eye. They added for any claims of disaster or dramatic changes in 2012, where is the science, where is the evidence, there is none, and for all the fictional assertions, whether they are made in books, movies, documentaries or over the internet, we cannot change that simple fact. There is no credible evidence for any of the assertions made in support of unusual events taking place in December 2012. The same applies this time around.